once upon a time on the flats of Minmus, a pilot unlike any pilot. Uh, there's no air there. A pilot. Okay. Once upon a time, there was a, a guy who could fly anything. And he was the captain. No, yes, the captain of the spaceship that would go way farther. This was just one of his many landings. His perfect, perfect landings. That went... Oh. That went really well. He had landed the impossible ship. He had landed the ship impossible. He had pulled off the impossible. He had survived landing the impossible. His survival, while considered impossible, actually happened twice. He landed two craft, one on Tylo, for which he was rescued in the first unmanned, well, partly manned mission to Tylo. Um, but he's a great pilot, a really great, the best. And our science team, let's talk about the engineer. The, the science team had been to pole with that. Our engineer had practiced the art of in situ resource utilization out on the grasslands of Kerbin for eons. He had And then, in a mission to Val, for decades, he eked out the tiny resource allotment, gaining five stars as a engineer, year after year, turning 2.51% ore into Sigh. Fuel for his return journey. But instead, instead, it was to jewel with him a from Val off he went to the outer planets. The scientists. Ray. The pilot. The engineer. And their ship. We Eel Dan. Hudski, Tan Lee, and Rosdok, the team of the <clears throat> uh, the Yonder Bee. The crew. The crew of the Yonder Bee, the team, the space team, <laughs> the space team of the Yonder Bee on their grand adventure. Uh, 
Um, Rosdoc, are you bored? Rosdoc, are you awake over there? Your eyes are open. <laughs> what was that? Um, I just had a funny thought. Yeah, what was the funny thought? Oh. I was thinking about how there's like nothing else except for us and the ship. You, me, the scientists. Yeah, they have names. Oh, uh, Yildan? Is that his name? Yeah. And and the other one? Um. Oh. Yeah. They have names. Anyway. It's just... You and me. Um... And them. Right. And then nothing. Just nothing. Yeah. Yo. I was... I always like having these eyes, you know, being a Kerbal with telescope eyes. Yeah, yeah. That's my favorite thing about being a Kerbal. Yeah, I like looking at the stars. I mean, it's not nothing. Yeah, but they're super far, 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 away. Yeah. Yeah, I guess they are. Hey, um, when I was taking a nap, I... I heard some clicking sounds. Uh, were you fiddling with the con- the uh, the toggles again? No, 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 I wasn't doing that. Cause you know, it's against protocol to fiddle fiddle with all the protocol all the toggles on. You know, yeah, it's, it's, I don't like like pulling rank on you and stuff, but. Don't play with the ship, please. Uh, I'm just, you know, making sure everything's still working. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good reason. <laughs> yeah. That's a good reason. It's gonna take a while. I was just looking at the navigation data. We're... Just past the orbit of Moho, and uh, we're on our way to what is it called? Neil Dan? Needan. Needan. Niden? Needan? Niden? Niden. I think it's Niden. Also, um, sometimes when I wake up, I find every single thing is deployed, and the ship is rotating back and forth. Sometimes, different directions than it was last time I checked. You know, um, it's okay to get bored, but don't just, don't, to- don't use the ship as a toy. It's not a toy, you know, I, I kind of feel like I'm always having to pull all the stuff back in. Bring it every last thing. I mean, do we really need the landing gear? No. I guess not. Um, not, not right now. I wonder what they're doing back at KSC. Yeah, me too. I hear something's breaking. No, it's just me clacking my teeth. You think they forgot about us? Probably. I think it's going to be something like 
72 years, if we're quick about it, before we're back home again. Oh, really? That's, uh, that's not taking into account, um, how long I'm going to have to take to refuel the ship, you know. Oh, that's right. How long do you think that'll be? It's going to be a hundred years or so. Just to refuel? Um, yeah. So 170 years, maybe. Maybe 175. Well, you know, if we are quick about it. Oh, yeah. Well, we'll have a chance to talk, I guess. Get to know each other. Right? Um, yeah.